In Iran, two more people have been executed on charges of leaking to the press information pertaining to the secret sale of arms by the United States. Iranian official news agency Irna reported that the two were accomplices of Mehdi Hashimi, the Iranian who was previously executed for leaking the news to the press. Torrential rains and floods which have been effective in southeast England have wrought great material damage. Rivers overflowing their banks in Hampshire and Sussex have left the majority of the cultivated fields underwater. In London, the ground floors of many buildings were flooded. The floods have crippled transportation in the region and work in the coal mines have been suspended. The 24th Antalya Golden Orange Film Festival ended last night with a ceremony. The awards were presented to the winners in 14 branches. While the film Mohsin Bey was deemed worthy of the first prize, Anna Yurt Oteli, Motherland Hotel, came in second, and Hayalerim Aşkın Besen, My Dreams, My Love and You, came in third. The Best Director Award went to Ömer Kavur, Best Actress to Türkan Şoray, and the Best Actor to Şener Şen. The satellite launched into space by the Soviet Union on September the 29th with two monkeys on board will return to Earth on Monday. The Soviet television broadcast certain scenes of the flight. He managed to untie his hands and started sucking on his nutrition tube. The Soviet official news agency TASS reported that the next flight will be realized with mice. And now the weather. It will be cloudy in patches in Marmara, while other regions will be slightly cloudy or clear. No precipitation is forecast for tomorrow and temperatures will remain much the less as today. Lowest temperatures of the night and the highest of tomorrow will be as follows. Ankara 11.25, Istanbul 15.22, Izmir 13.29, Adana 16.35, Gaziantep 8.28 degrees Celsius. And that was news. Good night.